Hey champions, it is Thursday. We are getting really close to the championship and there's a lot of exciting announcements to talk about before the event occurs. So let's get into it right away. We are only nine days away from the championship. That's right, nine days. We are in single digits. We are getting really close to the day of the event. Remember that the VIP tickets are only on sale until the 15th. So after that, we are not selling the VIP tickets, only the general admission tickets. So if you want to get all your special perks, the Anka Chi, the t-shirt, the promos, uh, everything that we are giving to the VIPs, then make sure you are getting your ticket before the 15th. After that, if you want to get some of those things, you're, some of them are going to be there at the booth for us to sell, but a lot of the other things uh, you're just going to miss out on. So that's, that's unfortunate. Uh, but we are getting really, really close to the event. So I'm excited about that. Uh, it's Thursday. I'm wearing my Heads or Tails t-shirt. They are be they're going to be doing a live stream tonight talking about Genesis. They do it every Thursday night. So if you're not following Heads or Tails Gaming, make sure you go and check that out. So something else that I want to mention that's happening at the championship. Uh, we've announced this, but one of our artists, Camilla, is going to be at the event. It's going to be really, really cool. Uh, I love sitting beside her and hearing her thought process, seeing her sketches, going through everything she's done. She started when we were working on Raze, so she doesn't have any pieces prior to Raze. But... Uh, if you have copies of these cards and you want to get signed, bring them to the event. I'm going to bring a bunch of spare copies for her to sign and give to people in case you don't have these cards. So don't worry too much about that. Uh, we'll also have some special things for her to sign and give away to people. So that's going to be really, really cool. I'm excited for this event. Uh, I'm excited to meet Camilla again. It's been a long time. I think last time I met her was during COVID, but it was in the earlier parts of it. And... Uh, we didn't sit down to chat. I just wanted to drop off the some uncut sheets for her to see all her cards in print. So that was really, really cool. Actually, one of my favorite artworks from Arrays, which is Secret, she did. And I love that piece. I love that she also hid her signature in the artwork. So if you get a chance to look at the full artwork, you'll have the opportunity to see, uh, find it there. And I like the way she did it. It's very much a surprise. And then something that I get... Kind of trolled about but it's all in good fun is uh, what i said one time on a live stream about the gelada baboon and how the artwork calms me but what i meant more is i love the color palette i love how the piece kind of comes together it's she did a really really great job with this artwork and on top of that it is a very meta relevant card so if you have copies of those if you have any foil cards that she did you'll be able to get those signed as well so Really excited to have her come to the event and meet the entire community. Uh, and then the last thing that we haven't, we've been talking about kind of behind the scenes, but we haven't done a deep dive into is the auction. Uh, every year at the championship or around the time of the championship, we do an auction. Uh, part of it is uh, we have a lot of collectible memorabilia throughout the history of Genesis that I know that as players, you would love to get your hands on. Uh, this means a lot to you. Some of these things mean a lot to me. They're part of my history. They're part of who I am as an individual. But they also mean a lot to you because this is a game that you love. And uh, that excitement, the passion that the players have for the community, it blows me away a lot of the times. I, When I started designing Genesis, I did not think that people would love the game as much as they do. Uh, especially when you get to meet Steve-O from Heads or Tails, you get to see he actually tattooed all the affiliation symbols on his hand. Uh, that's really crazy for me. Or when I go to uh, YouTube and I look up Shamrock, who does uh, content about Genesis, exclusively about Genesis, and his actual YouTube icon is the Baruch from uh, second edition. I'm like, that's really cool. That blows me away because I did not expect a lot of these people to fall so in love with the game uh and this is one of those things i'm realizing is it's just part of my character but it 
it can be a flaw at times is that sometimes I'm just really modest. I did not, I do not expect that what I put out there would be so well received and people will love it so much. So I am blown away by that. I'm humbled by that. I'm excited to continue growing this game and be dedicated to make something really awesome. But as we grow the game, as the things expand, it creates a history, a history that a lot of people don't get an opportunity to tap into and experience. And one of those pieces is Alpha. Alpha is, it was an extremely short print run. It was a, a proof of concept trial and error, see if we could sell it. If, it, if the Alpha product never sold at that first SkyCon event, it, Genesis would never have kept on going. I would have stayed at my job. I would never have pursued this in the way I did. Uh, so Alpha was a very special moment in the company's history. And for that, we want to share a piece of that with the community. So one of the things that is going to be going into the auction uh, is an Alpha Booster Box, a completely sealed Alpha Booster Box for you to bid on and get a chance to have that because there are very, very few of these floating around. Um, I know Steve has one. I have one. I gave one to my dad. But as far as I know, those are the only sealed boxes in existence. There is, there aren't many sealed uh, boxes altogether. Actually, I have one in my background. Let me put myself back up on screen. You can see it, it's right there. I got the Alpha Booster Box, the J2 Booster Box, uh, and I put it in my background. And it's th the opportunity to get one. It's very, very scarce. So if you don't get in first place at the championship, you can still get yourself an Alpha Booster Box. Part of the other reason why we do the auctions is because we're still a startup. We're growing and there are expenses that we put into the company that sometimes exceed our means. And one of them is the championship. We know that it's so important to host a championship, to do an event that is valuable for the community. But this year, we wanted to take it one step further. We wanted to do something that was maybe a little bit outside of our reach. And with the community support through the auction, we're hoping we'll be able to subsidize the exciting things we have planned for the championship. That is including live stream. Live stream will be happening of the championship on both fa on Facebook, Twitch, and YouTube. That's the goal is to get it on all platforms. Uh, so you got the live stream happening. We have a really amazing production crew that's going to be working behind the scene. We'll have photographers and videographers creating content for us to use for future things. And, uh, really put together an event that is really special for the community. So I'm excited that the championship is going the way it is because we're going to have the opportunity to do something really, really amazing for the community. I'm really excited about this and I can't believe that it's coming up so soon. So um, one of the other things that we're going to have at the event are small little posters. Uh, I haven't quite figured out how I'm going to be distributing these, uh, but I know that there are people who want them. So we got some made. Uh, they'll be at the event. If you're interested in getting one, let me know so I can figure out how to get these to everyone. And then on top of that, there's the VIP promos uh, that are really, really exciting. I'm excited. Uh, like It's our first deep dive into Origins. We saw the electric pillar. That was the first piece of the puzzle that was going up for the community to figure out how Origins is going to look like and what Phage looks like as a whole. But there is the VIP cards, which are also like actual cards from Origins that are going to be up there. So something I, uh, I'm getting ready for is, I don't know. I just, I think you should wait for the event. I got some really cool things that I want to display for that. Anyways, that is a lot of what is going on for the championship. I hope you're excited. I hope you're ready to see people come together and play the game. Uh... That is, I think, everything that I have to say about uh, the event for this video. And, I mean, it's just, it's coming up so soon. It's so soon. Um, the other thing, if you missed it in exploring the library, is we talked about the Kickstarter. I mentioned it yesterday. I mentioned it today in the Exploring the Library episode. Uh, there's been a lot of interesting behind-the-scenes talk. I've been noticing it also on the 
kitchen table TCG Discord group that they've been mentioning the Genesis Kickstarter. And I'm excited that people are excited for that. We've gotten a lot of positive feedback. We also got some negative feedback. And I do want to sit down and address some of those negative feedback. So if you have questions, concerns, queries about the Kickstarter, let me know. Let me put together a video for you talking about my sentiments behind it and why I think now's the right time to do it, uh, why we didn't do it in the past, and kind of where we're at as a company to make this a realistic dream to take everything kind of to the next stage. All right, that's it for now. Hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. The 2021 championship is coming up soon. It will be hosted on November 20th in Toronto, Ontario. If you are interested in competing, seats are limited, so sign up as soon as possible. To learn more, go to www.genesisboc.com slash championship. Let's get back to the video. I want to give a huge shout out and thank you to all our Patreon supporters. Without you, this game would not be where it is today. Thank you for being so awesome.